Hello, welcome to another quick fix. Uh, this is by the person who did The Hollow. A game that contained a certain amount of jank, but <coughs> it was still very well put together and I liked it a lot. This one contains less jank and is even well put together. And the reason I'm sat here on the start screen is because I think they've got a, a pretty good uh, grasp of presentation. And this shows how they've progressed in terms of menus and instructions and just overall presentation, basically. I just like that. Straightforward. Sound of typing. <coughs> and this, but this bit here, it's quite nice. It's only one level, and the creator is unsure whether he wants to uh, continue, but I would. I would definitely continue. What I like is the self-contained nature of this environment. Just to add a little bit of dynamism into this area, I would make those more random, though. Those white glowing orbs moving up and down. Randomise them. Make them move at different speeds and at different times. It would just add a little bit more... I don't know what the word is. Not realism, but a sense of randomness into the area. As it stands, it's it, it sort of... It, you know, it's just the same mechanic copied. But if you made them random, it wouldn't feel like that. It would feel like an actual machine, something act working. As opposed to something copied, if you get what I'm saying. It's only a small thing. I've got five gears, I can put that in here. Make myself a little battery. And grab the battery. Go through here, grab a few more gears. And look at this keypad code, which is up, down, left and right, which fits this door over here. But I like it. I like the fact that it's avoided the jankness when you walk over uneven ground. Always a good idea. A nice little smiley face to indicate you've done it correctly. Another little touch that I like and appreciate. And another upgrade. Install upgrade. Shock needle. So we'll go and we'll use this shock needle on this foe over here. I can actually go in here. Let's go this way first though. Oh, now I need the dash to get through there. Right, so these are, these are uh, baddies. I don't know if, how these react to shot needles. Oh yeah, they do die. That's cool. They're upgrade. I'm not really bothered about killing you. I think I'll just get out quick. I like I like the lights. See how these look more random? Because, I mean, they're obviously still running in the same sequence, but because they're at different angles and different orientations, they look more random. And I think that would serve this room well if you did the same. And just randomise those a little bit. So now I've got this dash to go through here. Get these. Operate terminal. Lower barrier. Yep, yeah, nice, nice. Nice little give a camera work there to show you exactly what's happened. Install upgrade. 
<coughs> lantern. Now I need to uh, get a next upgrade, which I can't remember where it is. I think I get up there somehow, but uh, I can't really figure out how. So now I go across here with this. Uh, there. I think this is rather well done. I've put this in my game section, so if you want to. Uh, oh, there you go. Double jump. go down there or that's just a yeah the camera needs sorting out I think now I've got this but I don't know if I'm supposed to get up there somehow don't really know how I'm supposed to get up there I don't know if it's just a matter of uh, whether you're supposed to just balance on these pipes. Those cogs are on the pipes, so I'd assume maybe I'm supposed to. But it's such a delicate thing, you fall off easy. So if it is that, then I would advise just... Well, this is about... <laughs> it's the first time I've been able to do it first like that. But this is too... Th these pipes are a little bit too thin. I was a bit lucky there, last time I tried this, I spent ages, and I couldn't do it. But this is cool. It's a nice, like I said, nice environment. I don't really know whether that's the end, that could be the end. So, yeah, definitely worth playing. Go and check it out on my in my collection of games, and follow the creator, because this is awesome. This is, well, it's not awesome. I, you know, I'm not going to throw the word out, awesome. <laughs> for anything but it's very good it's very good let's say it's very good well done this person go and play it